I guess one of the key bail conditions that we were appealing against today was the fact that, um, that we, we couldn't participate in uh, any authorised or not authorised protest against APEC. Um, that, that's a breach of everyone's right in Australia to protest, um, especially if it's organised. I mean, why can't we participate in an organised, non-violent protest? And that's what we, the, the key uh, thing of today and why we were, we were there. I've been involved in peaceful protest and as a non-violent direct activist on behalf of the environment movement since I was 19. For me, one of the cornerstones of democracy is that fundamental right to protest and to free speech. And the bail conditions that were originally placed on us were onerous and prevented our right of free speech, peaceful protest. It didn't allow us to meet with our co-accused for any purpose of protest. It could have been reasonably argued that by appearing today to argue our bail conditions, we were actually in breach of those bail conditions because we were protesting together as a group. That, to me, is a terrifying precedent to be set to disallow any Australian citizen or any citizen in the world the right to speak out and to speak their mind uh, is appalling and it's a breach of one of the cornerstones of democratic principles. One of the most interesting things about today was the prosecutor for the, uh, for the, uh, for the police was trying to he was talking about the fear and the violence that we would enact, um, and obviously Greenpeace, we're a non-violent organisation, we don't have any history of violence. Um, but the key point was the magistrate actually brought up uh, the point and questioned the prosecutor, what fear are you talking about? What is this fear that you're talking about? So I really think he engaged on all the hype around APEC and he sort of brought that to the forefront and said, what is this fear you're trying to, you know, to stir up that isn't, that isn't there? I mean, most people want to protest peacefully.